Hello everyone. Today I'm just going to do a walk around of this 2018 Tesla Model S P100D. So this has the upgraded hardware sensors for your level 9 or version 9 autopilot. And I'll just quickly introduce you to those and give you a location and quick explanation. So first and foremost here in the front windscreen you'll see right behind the driver's rear view mirror a cavity there and there's three forward facing cameras okay so those have primary purpose is to obviously detect the lane markings on the vehicle on the road first and foremost and also to detect vehicles on the road now, not new to Tesla, front bumpers are the uh, proximity ultrasonic sensors. There's three on this side of the car and three on this side of the car. Uh, used uh, primarily for object detection. Gives you a pretty, pretty precise uh, detail in the instrument cluster how close things are as you're par pulled up next to them or parked in front of them. Um, one sensor that you cannot see on the older Model S's and X's, you used to see right below the license plate a radar sensor. Now, since uh, late 2007 or 16, early 17, they upgraded the face or the front bumper and they put the radar sensor underneath the front bumper skin right here. Okay, so plastic doesn't affect the effectiveness of the radar sensor. So that's why they just put it behind the front bumper skin. But that's one thing, one updated version or updated uh, sensor location from the previous model. Now we'll walk to the side of the car and you'll see on the turn signal itself, you have a rearward facing camera and you'll have the same type of camera on the passenger side, both facing backwards. And then we're going to span here and located in the B pillar of the vehicle, you'll have kind of a forward facing camera this way. And uh, the same camera on the opposite side. And again, that is for the 360 degrees of camera view to enable the uh, advanced features on this car, as well as the rear facing camera right above the license plate. Okay, and then you'll notice on the back of the vehicle, more proximity sensors. So three on the passenger side, and three on the driver's side. Okay, that was just a quick tutorial on some of the exterior hardware features and sensors on the newer view on the newer Teslas to uh, help in object detection and autopilot functionality.